What's up guys? Coming back at you again with another uh, Xterra video. Today we're gonna be uh, swapping out these babies. These old crusty chrome lights. We're gonna switch them out for some halos today. Uh, me and my roommate Jacob will be working on it and perhaps our neighbor Alex. I'm not sure what his plans are for today, but perhaps him as well. Um, so right now, I'm getting out here. I'm gonna start taking the old lights off. I'm gonna see how that goes and then uh, Come back at you again in a little bit when we start to install the new ones. So these are the old lights here. Um, I took out the blinker and this light here, which is this big orange one. I don't really know what it's for. I guess it's kind of like a, uh, a side identifier. I don't really know what the technical name is, but I took those two lights out from both of them and I installed them in the new one blinker down here and like the identifier guy up here whatever it's called, did that on both lights. Now, we had to do a little bit of wiring to this guy for the two driving lights, the high beam, and I don't know which one's which, but one's a high beam and one's a regular one. All right, once I figure out how to do it, I will tell you how I did it. So in the meantime, um, I can't figure out how to do the wiring. I li have literally no experience doing that. So in the meantime, I'm gonna go back outside. Um, and the skid plate that is on my car that I did not plasti dip yet. I'm gonna go ahead and take that guy off. This guy right there, right there. I'm gonna take him off and I'm gonna go ahead and plasti dip that guy black so it matches the rest of the car in the front. And once my roommate wakes up and he knows a little bit more about wiring and everything, um, we'll go ahead and finish the headlights. All right, taped it off. For some reason I couldn't take the skip plate actually off. Uh, I don't know why, there's probably like some, uh, some attachments in here that I can't get access to without taking the whole bumper off and I don't feel like doing that. So I'm just gonna, I taped it off. Got one coat on there already. From a distance, it already looks pretty good, I think, anyway. It'll look real nice when I put the grill back on and match it all up. Um, so we're just waiting for the first coat to dry. Then we're gonna do probably up to four coats um, to make sure that it's nice and thick and stays on there very well. Um, so yeah, uh, stay tuned. And I'll show you what it looks like when it's actually done and hopefully uh, we'll get the headlights on as soon as possible. So. I can do stuff for the rest of the day. Yeah, because these hooks have to go up over. Yeah, I'm just trying to Alright, so go ahead and turn the motor. 
Yep. Right, so we got Halos, Halos three and, at the bottom. And, and three at the bottom. Okay. And that up top. Is that orange? Looks like it. Okay. It um, and now it's part. I didn't know it was orange. <laughs> I, didn't, I didn't think it was going to be orange. It's probably like a, like a little, it's probably like an amber. I can see the bulb up here. Yeah. Um, that's not even an LED. Oh, you just taped one in this kid's plate. I got it. That's <laughs> Turn signal's at the very bottom. Should work. Go ahead and turn your. Turn the car on. Is it making the? Oh yeah. Go ahead. Inner bulb will just kick on. So that's your... Which if you dug down, that's great. Yeah. 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 Uh huh. I always think the time might be a dumpy though. Is it on that? One is done. Working on the second one. Looks real nice. Actually, have to drop the bumper to get access to it. Jake's super excited to be in the video. So excited. I'm famous. <laughs> Hi, Mom. <laughs> hey, hey, hey. Everybody gives, oh. everybody gives me that hick reputation. I freaking hate it. I mean, you wear boots. I wear boots because that's what I've worn for the past how many years. I wear boots to work every yeah. day. Yeah, right. Exactly. All right, guys. Taking a slight break, finishing up on the Plassey Dip. We got one of the headlights working. We got this one working right here. This one's all good to go. We're having a little bit of problems with this guy. Um, all the lights down here are working, and this guy's up here is working. The halos are working, except everything is working except the uh, the low beams and the high beams. And we think that there's something wrong. But if you can see in here with the wiring that this plug connects to, there's a problem with it, we're thinking with this guy. Um, so Alex is gonna come back after this his dog's out and we're gonna try and rewire this guy. And hopefully that works, otherwise we might have to get new bulbs to fit in there. Um, but yeah, so it's taking a little longer than originally planned, but uh, <laughs> <laughs> That's sweet ride. Right. Look at this. Two thousand Honda Civic. Doesn't really run. But yeah, so this is Plastic Dip Project. We're going to skip away. We'll focus on that guy. Looks pretty nice. I hope it's all said and done. Uh, but hopefully we can get that rewiring worked out and it's all good to go. Whew. We're finally done. It is now 4.10 in the afternoon. Uh, we probably spent five hours trying to get this, these headlights in. And now they're finally in and it, I think it looks amazing. I finished the Plasti Dip on the brush guard, or sorry, not the brush guard, the skip plate. And uh, I think it looks pretty good. Um, let me know what you guys think in the comments. And yeah, let me uh, show you guys what it looks like. All 
All right, and there it is. Um, if you guys would be interested in getting these headlights for yourself, I can go ahead and link them in the description, or uh, you can just comment below if you want to want the the link to it, um, and I can just comment back and give it to you that way. Whichever is uh, I end up doing. Um, all right, and that that is that. That is the installation of the halo lights. I am super excited to have them on there. I think they look fantastic. Um, I really want to thank my roommate Jake and my neighbor Alex. Um, he, we wouldn't have been able to do it without him. He, like, he's he knows what he's doing. He's an expert. Like, he works in a body shop. That's what he does for a living. And uh, he was nice enough to come over here and help me do it out. Uh, help me get these babies in. And even better, he he did it for free. So. Um, I want to give a huge shout out to him. Uh, super nice guy, awesome. Uh, really knows what he's doing, and uh, we got him working out. Even though we had a little bit of uh, a problem getting the uh, the right light working, but um, yeah, that is that. That's the latest mod to the uh, Nissan Xterra. If you guys keep wanting wanting to see more Xterra videos, uh, make sure to give a thumbs up and subscribe. So that way you get a notification every time that I post a video. Alright guys, peace.